Hello and welcome to the YG 90 Second News. I'm Jo. And I'm Max. And we're from the Priory with Academy. First, we have some Royal Baby News, or should this be hashtag Royal Baby News? For the first time ever, the arrival of the Royal Baby will be announced via Twitter and then outside Buckingham Palace. There have been mixed reviews from the public with some preferring a tra- traditional announcement of the easel outside of the palace. It's been a super weekend for Marvel's Avengers franchise, which is broken or in Hulk's terms, smashed the record for biggest ever April opening at the UK box office. They took £18 million pounds in the box office, which is the biggest ever for a superhero movie. The film features new character Vision, who combines all the powers of the Avengers to create the ultimate superhero. Will the third Avengers film smash the box office when it's released in 2017? We'll have to wait and see. Keep watching. Now, on to some political news. As you may all know, the general election is coming, approaching, and the public will cast their votes on the 7th of May at local polling stations. There are seven parties in the running, including the main three, the Conservatives, Tibbs, Labour and the Liberal Democrats with the Green Party, UKIP, SNP and Plaid Comrie also campaigning heavily at the moment in the election runoff. There have been many debates on TV where each party showcased what they plan to do if they win the election, with some getting very heated, making us all at home hang on the edges of our seats. The results will be decided on the 7th of May, revealing who will be the next Prime Minister. That's all from us. Bye! Bye.